Well, it's definitely a favorite of a lot, but Esther, for anyone who's never been to the East Side Cultural Crawl, um, this is just one of the many studios participating, right? Yes, this morning we're at Octopus uh, Studios. It's one of 84 studios. We have 430 artists who are exhibiting their work this year at the Crawl. Fantastic. Now, we've obviously got some artwork here, but there are a number of different kind of artisans, correct? Yes, we have the full range. We have sculptors, we have painters, we have photographers, we have uh, jewelry making, we have ceramicists, we have guitar makers. Matt Kim right now is working on guitars and he uses what kind of materials? Well, he uses a lot of found objects and I think we're going to get to some of the objects that he uses to make his guitars. We absolutely are. Now, we should point out that the Eastside Culture Crawl starts tonight and runs through Sunday. That's correct. We have four days of artists opening up their studios to the public and we welcome anybody and everybody to come down and see what these creative souls are making. Wonderful and what an excellent experience for many people to be able to be exposed to so many different artists in one geographical area. That's right. We run over to uh, First Avenue up to Victoria Drive and then west to Main, north to the waterfront. So people can pretty much make their way by foot. Wonderful. So many options. For more details on the East Side Culture Crawl, of course, you can go to their website. And coming up later, we will chat with Kim and these beautiful guitars. All right, who doesn't love a wonderful guitar? But imagine a guitar made, in, made of things that you just don't even expect. Kim, first of all, sorry to interrupt you. Good morning. Good morning. What are you doing right there? I'm carving a neck out of walnut for the next guitar. Okay, so that kind of is probably pretty standard as far as a guitar goes, yeah. right? You got yeah. necks all That's kind right. of look the same. These guitars are unbelievable. Tell us a little Thank bit you. about these guitars. They're all made from found objects or what would be discarded by most people. So something like a cigar, bar, a cigar box. The cigar box, yeah, it came out of a, a local junk store here. Um, that one came out of my closet. So these are things that basically thought, you know what, these are going to be great um, items that we can use for instruments. And of course, you're one of the artisans for the Culture Crawl. What came first, the art or the musicianship for you? I started as a musician, and that's how I build my guitars, with that bias in mind. So these are guitars that are nice to play as well, including this one here, actually. Nelson, let's show this again. Tell us about this guitar here. Uh, that is owned by a Montreal musician, and he has played that all over the world. So they are guitars that are made for the stage. I love it. Now, you also do custom work. Tell yes. us about this newest addition to your, I want to call it a line. I don't know if I can call it a line when you're an artist. Maybe I can. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us sure. about that. Uh, that's a piece to show what you can do. Like, what do you want? So if you love, you know... Michael Jordan. Yes. You go, man, I wish I had a guitar made of a shoebox. Yeah. Man, where do you get your inspiration from? I try and build, um, I like to build with what nobody's done before. I know that nobody has ever built a guitar out of a shoebox. And you're just finishing that, so people will actually hear its debut yes. performance, I guess, at That's the right. Eastside Culture Crawl. Right. I'm going to let you get set up with this guitar here. You're going to play it for us uh, just as we get ready to go back to the studio. Tell us briefly about this one This here. is a, a biscuit tin guitar that came out of a horse barn. A horse barn. Well, guitars made out of absolutely everything. Go ahead and play that if you'd like. For more details, of course, on Kim, uh, you can come and check him out at the Eastside Culture Crawl taking place tonight through Sunday. Lots of great artisans there back at the station. Be sure to make your way. Wow.